can't do that now. Hi. I'll let you go. Talk to you later. That's done. Did that. This could be helpful. Nancy, I'm so sorry I wasn't able to meet you in person. Oh, that's okay. Is something wrong? Yes, something is very wrong. Some of our exhibit pieces have gone missing. Are they lost or...? Stolen. I don't know. And frankly, it doesn't matter. The pieces in question, they're worth millions. If I can't recover them, our doors are as good as closed. I'm here for you. Anything you need. Oh, thank you. A lifetime of thank yous. I still need you to do the job we brought you on for, and you'll find everything you need for that in the office. But more importantly, I need you to be my eyes and ears. Does that mean you think we're dealing with theft? I really hope not, but we can't rule that out. But you're worried. I am. Okay, why is that? The pieces we lost never arrived. They were on the shipping invoice, but they were not in the crate. Is that common? It could be a simple mistake, or it could be someone changed the invoice to buy enough time to smuggle the jewelry out. I'm tracking down both possibilities. That's why I need you here. You got it. I'm following the paper trail now, and with luck, I'll find the error and be back tomorrow. You worry about that. I'll take care of the museum. Great. You'll find everything you need in the office. Can I get a key to the coin display? You'll need to open the filing cabinet first. The key to the filing cabinet is hidden inside the box with the animal figurines. Pair up the animals with the images so the animal and image pair represent the same god. You got it. I know you weren't brought here for this, but I need you to learn about provenance. As in verifying the authenticity of the art? You're as sharp as they say. That's it. Isn't that normally left to the experts? Generally, yes, but if we're dealing with theft of any kind, I need you to become an expert. Instantly? Unfortunately, but you'll come to it naturally. I'm flattered, but what makes you say that? You will find that it's like solving a mystery which I hear you're pretty good at at home. I'll do my best. Proving provenance is a classic whodunit. You look at a vase or a painting and you follow the clues to see who... done it. Who painted or sculpted or chiseled the work in question. When you put it that way, I think I'm comfortable with the methodology. Perfect. You'll find what you need on the computer. Niobe may be able to help you.
Do you suspect that anyone in the cast took the missing jewelry? We did at first. But then? The police came in, interviewed everyone, and the cast was very cooperative. That's good at least. Maybe. Maybe? They all consented to having their cars and hotels searched. The police reviewed all of the security footage and came to the conclusion that no one in the cast snuck anything out of the museum. But you doubt this? For all intents and purposes, they're cleared, but it just doesn't make sense. Nothing just disappears. I should tell you, Niobe broke one of the necklace display cases. What? She said she was trying to trace the detail work and put too much pressure on the glass. Is everything still there? I think so. Well, thank Zeus for that. How did she react when you talked to her about it? She was really upset. She actually asked me not to tell you. Like no one would notice. <sighs> These things do happen. Keep an eye on her. Mistakes happen, but a series of mistakes don't. Got it. Goodbye. Goodbye. The password must be around here somewhere. This is the exact book I needed. Oh, thanks, guys. Hello. Do you know much about Greek mythology? Here, take this, you'll love the myths. They're full of the most amazing insanity. I'm glad we don't live in that world, for the most part. What do you think of Thanos? He's coarse. Maybe that's good for playing Hades. I don't think he acts, I think he was typecast. As what? A monster. Do you know much about proving provenance? Sure. I have some materials for you. Here. Bye-bye. Until later. I need to match the animals to the correct symbol.
These must be the tags for the display. I need to assign seats according to everyone's requests. Looks like I'll need a unique password to access the archives. Wanna know a secret? Are the seats packed with the dead? Should I line you up and punch you down into the land of the dead? Well. Do you want to know a secret? So polite. Oh, I mustn't talk in the theater. Curses for all the gods. I've gone and broken the fourth wall. But no bother. Your beloved real world is itself theater. You're used to pretend, used to believing what you want to believe. For the next 90 minutes, I will be telling you lies and you will agree they are the truth. That's actually more or less what's printed on my business card. Hermes, messenger to the gods, certified liar, founder and CEO of Olympic Scandal Magazine, inventor of gossip. I'll be handing these out after the show. Mercury keeps poaching my clients these days. Roman gods, pff, cheap knockoffs. Bacchus is a cool guy. The rest, forgeries of our greatness. Except no substitutions. Now, as I was saying, do you want to hear a secret? Yes. I'm also the guide to the underworld. Hades, the old Greek soul closet. Little known fact about being dead. Death is very boring. Not much happens in Hades. It's just a lot of souls being dead in chairs, being dead at breakfast, dead souls just wandering about. That's the gist of it. I mean, every four years, we have our own Olympics, but we've yet to fully figure out soul physics. Archimedes is doing his best, but we're still no closer to finding the pole vaulters. They just went, you know, just gone. Quite floaty and dearly missed, like spice ships at sea. So you must understand my interest was piqued when I discovered the underworld exploding with news, curiosity, intrigue. A mysterious young woman was coming so beautiful, so sad, so frightened. Yet those were not the qualities that drew the land of the dead to watch her every move. No, what moved them so was that this girl was alive. I have a tragic tale to tell. A story of three gods who conspired and fought over the fate of one lost girl. It's a story I've told before. Sometimes the maiden, Persephone, returns home, escapes from Hades unscathed, and sometimes the dark forces of the underworld prevail. Zeus, how does the story end? You just want me to skip everybody else's lines? Okay. I was gonna say, I just. It's on nine? I only have. I was gonna say, I don't know. 
next one, or the next speech. Oh, okay, let me find the next speech here, which is in here somewhere. Hermie, there's a little speech. Oh, there it is. How are you not cold? It's, it's cold, very chilly, pretty nippy. It's, it's pretty nippy indeed, my friend. The big Z is not feeling chatty, I see. Could that be because I convinced you to marry off Demeter's daughter and now she's destroying life as we know it? Eh, probably it. I hate it when you're angry. Makes swans even more untrustworthy than they already are. Some people say that death has a twisted sense of humor. I assure you, death has no sense of humor. Speak of the Greek analog of the devil, and the Greek analog of the devil appears. Shut it. Speak of the Greek analog of the devil, and the Greek analog of the devil appears. Shut it. I would love to shut it, but I need clarification on which it I must shut to make you happy. Shut your mouth, or I'll shut you in an airless cell under the river's fire. There it is. Zeus! I'm afraid this one's on me, darling. The big guy is peeved. Have you noticed that you've been getting a bit more boat traffic these days? The harvest is always strong. You're about to run into some economies of scale issues. Speak plainly. Demeter has frozen the world. You're about to be swimming in corpses. I am prepared. We're not. Not so much. I have taken my queen, the queen you gave to me. Whoa, whoa. Introduced, not gave. I guess it depends on the culture and the era. And if one party is a nymph, and the other party, and the other party the second most powerful god, and if one party is a nymph, and the other party the second most powerful god, eh, I guess it depends on the culture and the era. I've always said that. I said that just earlier. You are great, but you're giving back your queen one way or another. Listen, let's calm tensions. The god economy has not been great. We're not in the shape to have a god war here. Let's be civil. Civility is weakness in practice. Practice makes perfect. Sort it out with Demeter. Persephone is my queen, and so she will remain. I suppose I'm left to deal with, I suppose I'm left to deal with this, but I also suppose this is more or less my fault. I'm having a me day. You have my sympathy. And you have mine, Hermes. I just drove a train through that pause, people, come I was on. Trying to cry. Yeah, I just drove a train through there. Okay, uh, okay. I mean, you know, I'm not gonna just throw her. I'm not gonna like throw it on her. Way too much silence. Okay, just pick it up a little bit. Okay, okay, pick it up a little bit. Start over, Hermes. You, 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 you get to say it mouth. again. I mean, it's not exactly my place. Demeter, you have my sympathy. And you have mine, Hermes. She was here when he took her. Do you want to know how I know? Of course, my dear. The grass dies under my feet. Do you see the color drain from the hills? Can you hear the cracking of the leaves? The crunch of dead bones? The drum-tight skin of soil gone cold? We all do. As do I. This is not my will. Persephone is safe. This I promise. The fruits and grasses, do you know how they came to be? They come in dreams. Speak up a little bit more, Niobe. I dream of being new and small, warm in the soil. A little bit more. Wet by the rain. Wet with rain. Slowly waking as the warm face of Helios fills my soul with restless joy. I begin to listen moment by moment. I be This is really long. It's a monologue. It's, it's excessive. No, this no, I don't stupid. think so. Why is it stupid? Because if she's truly in grief, she wouldn't. F she wouldn't ramble on. Oh yes, this is this is stupid. Why? If she's if Demeter is really sad. Why would she continue on and on and on, especially to someone who hurt her so much? This is not quite reality. It's a play. We're using words to describe how we feel. Most actors would love this. I mean... I love this. Okay, okay. I feel the wishes above 
the grass. The hare wishes for clover. Perhaps I will grow to be clover. The man wishes for an olive. You you missed an N. It's for, for an olive tree to grow near his home. Oh, if I could be an olive tree, I would. And when I wake and step into the day, my dreams take root. How do you feel about that? How do you feel about your dreams taking root? I think you're rather ripping them up now, aren't you? I feel like if I was in mourning, I would keep my mouth shut. I don't know you would know what mourning is like. Okay, we're, no, 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 completely off topic, of let's just focus. Sorry. When Persephone focus. was growing inside me, that might be a bit Jeez. much yeah. for the art crowd. A bit much for the art crowd. Did you hear? Yeah, bit I much know. for the art <laughs> crowd. <laughs> <laughs> just, just go with it, it's fine, it's fine. What would you know about art? She joined me in my dreams. We grew together in the soil each night. In those dreams, I taught her how all things grow. Seed by seed, we grow strong into the sky together. And when I woke, she continued to dream? She continued to dream. It's a statement. She continued to dream. The night before she was born, she appeared as the girl I had yet to meet. Can, we, can I say my yeah, can, You can do whatever you want to do. The night before she was born, she appeared as the girl I had yet to meet. And she took me by the hand. She led me toward a tr towards... You missed an S. She led me towards a tree I had never seen before. It was small and wild. A spray green dotted with red bulbs. With red bulbs? You're really excited about that. A spray, a spray green dotted with red bulbs. That's a little bit better, yeah. Yeah, that's good. No matter how you direct it, the writing is just silly. Stop criticizing the script. We have a bigger job here to do. Well, then cut the, lines. the script in half and get Save on the with lines. the rest of the job. She plucked a strange, she plucked a strange new fruit for me. It was her creation. It was her gift to me. She is a very special young woman. That sounds really creepy. I understand how you must. Okay, okay. Up. You do not understand. What we have some other things to do, and you won't cut the script, so I'm just going to keep going, okay? Niobe, that's enough. I mean, we are wasting precious time here. I was not brought here to act, as I clearly can't. In the interest of time, can I keep going with your precious script? Now again, she's in my dreams, only now she's slipping into death. We're not quiet. Seeds waiting in bloom were prisoners clawing through stone. Every night I dream of digging down, tearing the very earth apart with my hands until the bones break loose, the skin rubs away, and I've bled all the blood left in me. And at last, when I break through, I reach down for her, I feel her fingers, her reaching out as desperately as me, and I pull with every bit of strength I have, and when I wake and when I step out into the day, I see that I have only pulled more death into the world. That's how I'm going to do it in the performance. You're gonna run out of air. That is how I'm going to do it! You do not have any control over me when I am actually on stage. Okay. All right, let's just continue. I don't know how to make the dream stop. You have to let her go. These flowers don't die. All else dies, but not these flowers. That is how I know she was taken from me here. Until she returns, all life will frost and crumble. Torn down to dry bone and rock. The wind will spit dust, but these flowers will never die. Think of Persephone. Is this what she would want? You have no right to speak of what she would want. Can we get a little less space, Captain? A little more... Delivery God! Please think of all the th living things. Why do we keep going back to this? I'm not going back to anything! Yes, you yes. keep rewriting you want? it. He's creepy, right? Do you agree? He's kind Look, of creepy. You we were supposed what? to do there a character conference. I was set to do it. We never did it. And now I'm trying to feel what? the is dreaming with me, but right. when she wakes, she finds she has pulled more life into the underworld. If that is so, let all living things die so she will never be alone. Never feel far away from love. And when it is done, when it is all done, maybe then I will be allowed to cross the burning river. Zeus will never allow you to carry out this plan. He has no control over me. He can be persuasive. How can he stop me if I can't stop myself? What? What was that, Niobe? I think that's the first real bit of acting I have seen all day. That was beautiful. Oh my gosh. Just keep going. Keep going. We will be that. reunited in life or in death. It makes no matter to me. 
Okay, maybe I take that back. Can you just a little bit more energy? You just said it was good acting. Now you're saying it's no, not you, energy. Uh, you don't understand the difference. Just, just, okay, we're going back to more energy. We will be reunited in life or in death. It makes no matter to me. Can you feel the chill? The white winds of... What? There are no winds in Olympus. How do you know that? Because I studied Greek art, you nincompoop. How do you draw wind anyway? Olympus, Olympuses, Olympus peaks. That is a very strange string of words. The white winds of Olympus peaks are descending into the valleys below. The rivers glaze with mud and ice. Hades has stolen my life. I will steal his debt. Thank <laughs> you.